<laughs> got it. Oh, do you have to like accept it? I have to, you know, got it. <laughs> it doesn't matter on my end. You just won't be able to see anything, right? <laughs> Hello, everybody out in YouTube land. Um, welcome to the Sun Dragon Sideshow. We're on AK edition. <laughs> I was like, have you forgotten all your lines? No. <laughs> like, we'll hold up signs later. Okay. But it's not really the, we're on AK edition. It's, That's it's, it can be the adventures of Liz and Rebecca, but we're just, yeah we're at home <laughs> hi i'm rebecca i'm the owner of sun dragon art and fiber in downtown but we're not there brevard north carolina <laughs> minion. say that again because your phone i'm liz i'm the minion there i got the opinion that's about it so <laughs> just in case i'm having you repeat it because it could be that what i'm hearing is not what the microphone picks up but hi everybody we i i feel like liz kind of promised we'd do this so we're doing this <laughs> Oops. <laughs> no that's no, all good um we we took this last week off it's already sunday like i thought about doing this during the week and then we just life you know so we are back at work on tuesday so y'all see us again in a couple more days at work the way we normally film, but we thought we'd do a really, really brief, quick, fun hi from home. So for anyone who's been absolutely bereft because we haven't been with them, hi. <laughs> so Liz, what have you been doing with your vacation? This is my new office. What do you, yeah. what do you care to share? We don't have to share everything. but um, I, I keep getting distracted by projects that are old, even though I brought home new projects. And um, I finished one, but it's not here. And I'm almost done with the second one, but I have to get more yarn. <laughs> oh, you ran out of yarn? And the I shop is closed. For like one sleep. Oh, man. Have, you know, half or less than half a ball, but it's the, the cable. Can you see the cables? Oh, I can totally see the cables. That's awesome. Yeah, but... Kitty running out of yarn so like that's not gonna get done so yeah well and i i actually said to liz hey let's maybe only talk about one project or or you know and save everything else we can for tuesday which means hauling a lot of stuff into the shop on tuesday probably but um we want to keep this brief so people who 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 don't come to knit night or don't watch my videos on the other channel this is avi yeah yeah, you don't want me touching you right now, huh? But you just meowed. So there's my kitty. Um, this is my house. Oh, he's oh, I just set him into stalker mode. That's gonna be fun. You might be able to see an attack on on live TV. <laughs> I'm sorry. And you have a sweater on. I well, yes. So that'll deflect the blow, but we don't usually capture this on camera. So um <laughs> I shouldn't have introduced him. This is how long my hair is. Oh, oh, what are you doing? I know. We're going to give him a second. That's better. That's not attack mode. That's just grumpy mode. Okay. This is how long my hair actually is for people who haven't seen it before. I just, it makes it easier to keep it up and with a mask on and all that fun stuff. So, um, so, um, how about I was I was gonna share flip side of what you did being distracted by old projects. I have been working on some old ones, but I've also been thinking about all the old ones that I want. I was like, oh, I should work on these, but I started new ones instead. So I kind of tried to mix it up. Hmm. Shocker. Yeah, I know. I know. But um I'm also I also did a lot of not knitting. Like if I had devoted myself like I did over Christmas to knitting, I probably could have busted out a ton of stuff. And I tried kind of not to and not having a schedule and taking breaks from knitting or not getting to knitting has felt really weird. I will say that. I had all these adulting things to do. I am so proud that you slept until 1031 one day. 
you woke up at 7 30 and then went right back to sleep which yeah. i'm so so proud i think i slept in a few times but i also think i stayed up late either the same day or the next day so it's like is that really resting that that works i'm just so proud <laughs> <laughs> um i I started and basically finished all but the end parts of two small projects with our new yarns, which I will, I will keep till Tuesday. Um, I tried to work on finishing up some stuff, but the, the one thing I thought I would share knit wise, um, is I've been working on the, my wedding blanket for my cousin. So, um, and this is the one that like this, I was showing this before we, I pushed the record button and I'm loving how I think when I block this, the pattern is going to show up really crystal clear. This is the one that I, I haven't brought into the shop for a while because it's kind of big and it's hard to transport and yeah, we'll see. But I've been changing colors. I'm holding two skeins. Like right now I'm holding um, the almonds and the A crew together. This is my last color combo on this. But each time a ball runs out, I change one of the colors. So I had like, I have like a light gray and, and a charcoal and then charcoal and, and a green and a green and a blue and then a couple different blues and a blue and navy. <laughs> navy and um, uh, like bitter chocolate. And then chocolate and walnut heather, walnut heather, and um, the latte, that latte color, latte and almond. And now I'm doing almond and um, and the acre. So it's a lot of names to remember. And I didn't remember all of them right. But each one gives me about six inches unblocked. Like I'm hoping when I block this, if I try to block this, the best I'm going to do is... Um, is maybe hang it off that, hang it over that while it's damp and and see if it stretches out nice. And if that doesn't work, I might give it to Astrid to block and say, I tried already. Can you do any better? I don't think what this is as big as what you had Astrid block though. So it mine came out six feet square. Okay. I think if Astrid aggressively blocks this, it might come out like that. But I'm I'm kind of hoping I can handle it on my own here. I'm gonna do an experiment. I'm gonna go behind the the couch and try to hold this up to see if people can like. I have it on a forty inch cord up here, so that's but that's not the full width of it. It's it's jammed on here, right? So hang on a sec. Bobby's watching you. Of course he is. He's like, where are you going? What are you doing? So I've got ends all over the place to weave in on this thing. And I'm oh my not God. To... Huh? That is huge. It's huge. But I also feel like it's not big enough, but it's huge. You know, it's it's for a couple. I, I want it to be big enough they could use it on the couch. So oh. <laughs> like more than just a snuggle blanket. Like yeah. <laughs> well, I mean, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. It's gonna have nine stripes in it. And each stripe was two balls of Cascade 220 basically until it ran out. So there's a lot of yarn in this. And the cat's like, ooh, because the cat's been snuggling under this. So I'm holding this up. Yeah. So people can see almost all of it. That looks so cool. I think it's I, really, really cool. I, I think it it's a bed size blanket, not just a snuggle on the couch blanket. Yay. I hope they like it because I had an idea in mind and I wanted it to be like neutrals, but the blues kind of pull it out of the neutrals. But I didn't have enough colors if I only use the browns and the grays. So I, blues, because blue you can use with browns or grays. So I, blues like help. And we've discussed blues can be a neutral. So, you know, like well, that. Right. And, and here's the thing is that I don't know what colors their house is. So, um, and I wasn't sneaky enough to do the detective work and stuff on that. So I'm going to come around front again, but I think that's going to be awesome. I wanted people to get a glimpse of this because I may or may not be able to bring it into the shop when it's done. Well, I'll bring it into the shop when I'm going to mail it. Cause that'll be the easiest way to mail it. But, um, ugh. 
but I wanted people to be able to kind of get some kind of glimpse on it because I don't know if I'll be able to to bring it in for filming. I hope to. It's only going to get about six inches bigger on that unblocked. And then I'm going to cast off. So I, I think also it is a great A weighted blanket for a bed and B, they live up north. It gets cold. They live, They're they live in New York. Yeah. So <laughs> I, I'm hoping they will like it. So, you know, it's, I I've said before, I made, um, a really crazy complicated quilt for his brother when his brother got married and I'm sure it's in a drawer somewhere, but that's okay. Cause I had fun making it. So, um, yes. And the cat was snuggling. If you go to my Instagram, you can see the cat, like I had it on my lap while I was knitting it. And the cat just climbed right in. Like there's all kinds of fuzzies from the cat, either licking it or clawing it. I've been trying to protect it from the cat just sleeping on it. But the bottom half of it, when I was making it, was in timeout for a while and the cat just sat on it. So, you know, it's going to have some cat has crafting with a pet. Yes, you know. <laughs> um, my week has been full of all kinds of adulting type stuff though, because I had a tree fall on my car and it, in the possibly least damaging way possible but still damaged it on monday i was not in it y'all i was fine um it is out being fixed right now so the miracle is even though i have a, a scion that hasn't been made in years it's somehow they found parts for it yay and so i had to take care of that i had to take care of um avi went to the vet um i got my booster shot so did you yeah so the new booster like we've been, we've been doing all these adulting things all week. What's up with that? I have not exactly been adulting other than my booster. Okay. Fact, so you'll be more rested when we go back? I, I have, my brother's <laughs> like, you're not an adult. You're sleeping till 1030 plus in the morning. Like, I'm like, yeah. Uh, when I went to go get my booster the first time, I forgot my shot record saying you know and she was like oh where's your shot record and I went crap and <laughs> so definitely not adulting you weren't prepared <laughs> I was prepared I it just I I made an appointment for the next day because they were packed and so anyway I went back the next day and yeah no I've I've been doing a whole lot of like avoiding life but that's that was the whole point of our break like it's what I do gonna do <laughs> yeah for me I got um I got all caught up in the adulting things that had to get done or I chose to get done and that distracted from my ability to like rest but I'm not very good at resting anyway so yeah I don't know people can tell us if we look more rested we don't we don't have the lighting and not that we have <laughs> fancy lighting at the shop but you know I decided to film here in my living room rather than where I usually film that has lots of bright lights on me. And that's, who knows if that's a pro or con. So I did the film in the same spot that I am in for knit night. Knit night. So, well, that's, this is where I am for knit night yeah. too. So instead and of then, they set up for filming. Say that one more time. Instead of normally where I film specials in the, my office area. Yeah. So, so anyone who doesn't come to virtual sit and stitch gets a little bit more of a glimpse of what virtual sit and stitch is like, and encourage you all to come to the zoom sit and stitches, which we have been taking a break from this past week as well. They'll, they'll start up on Tuesday, this Tuesday. I'm both looking forward to going back to the shop and wishing I had more time off. <laughs> Cause I miss everybody and I miss work because I actually don't do well without a schedule but it is exhausting so yeah we will see y'all can come Tuesday and see if we look more rested or not <laughs> um yeah I don't know if I had too much more to say I just knew proof of life hi everybody we're, we'll look at us. Right. we're resting you know, Tuesday, and then by Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, oh, yay, we get a break. Ah, you know, um, I think part of me is, uh, th this is a reminder that we've got 
two more days on our 20% off if anyone wants to take advantage of that, of what's in the online shop. It's online only. Um, we're not available by phone to help, unfortunately. Um, and it's B ampersand, the and sign L recharge, all one stuck together thing, um, saves you 20% in the online shop until we return on Tuesday. So that works through Monday night. But other than that, I mean, I, I do have some fun things to show off. I have some things that I don't know if it's enough to sh show progress and a whole lot of things here. I said, Ooh, I could finish that or work on that or do that. And that didn't happen. Okay. But, you know. Well, now that my green sweater isn't getting finished, I can at least get to sleeve separation on my two new things. Well, there you go. You can do a fashion show with the dude. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> the done till here part <laughs> all right um yeah the cat is now happy because he's on the blanket i was maybe gonna work on the blanket this afternoon and and now it's a maybe not probably not depends on i mean this isn't right next to him but yeah <laughs> he's close. what he's close enough yeah i feel like there's a thing with zoom in your phone that it's just if if i'm making any noise it's like nope nope let's focus on no anyway um so hopefully y'all get enough of a taste i mean you only have two more days until you see us again um i'll get this video up as soon as i can and yeah we i think we look maybe a little a little rested your 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 mouth moved in <laughs> alive <laughs> ah that's what she said okay <laughs> all right when we're back in the same place then we don't have to worry as much because we'll have one mic for the two of us so um yeah we saw each other like once over break and other than that we do we we, we facetime and and text and stuff so yeah we've been surviving so i hope everyone has had a wonderful week and we will see you all back at the shop um in a couple of days right yeah. All right. So I don't know. I, this is totally, we just said we should film something and this is what we did. So we will, we will see. Oh! <laughs> we'll get back to our normal routine, which will feel really weird and probably be awkward um, in a couple of days. So bye everybody. Bye. We'll see ya. <laughs>